Why is relationship banter, arguments, division so popular? Fully agree with what Michael's saying is that there's just such a need for leadership uh, for young men these days. I guess my question is, it's not a zero sum game. Like for, for forever, we've heard that it's the patriarchy, and this is this is basically has given a rise to modern day feminism. And then you see things like the future is female, where it's like, what does that? If the future is female, what does that mean? for men, right? And then you see things like the feminism and the boss babe movement and everything with that. It's men and women can both win, right? I think women want a strong man in their life and men want a, you know, what's the famous phrase behind every great man, there's a strong woman. So how can men and women win in today's society? What do you guys think? Well, listen, that's going to be pretty difficult because when you watch television, you see it could be black people, it could be white people. It's confrontation between man and woman. That's all you see on television. That's what you see on housewife show. That's just what you see. You see this on um, Kevin Samuels show. You see this on sometimes, what's the other guy? Andrew Tate. It's just yeah. confrontation. Mm -hmm. Confrontation sells. And we're not going to stop this confrontation. This is going to become an error. So we can continue to make money off of people's pain. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. There it is, that simple. The era of confrontation. That is bullshit. That